Costas. Uh, I'm married to Alicia. I'm a husband, father, entrepreneur, and we live in Olivia, Minnesota. Uh, Alicia and I first met, I was in seventh grade, and she was in eighth grade. Uh, I fell in love instantly, uh, but I always joke around that she didn't really know I existed until she was a senior in high school. So we, we kind of knew each other, but I was in that friend zone, and I had to get out of that friend zone. And it took some time, a lot of time actually. We've been married for almost 10 years in September, um, but been together almost 18 years, because we've been together more than half our lives. We have three boys under the age of five. Our household is busy, as you can imagine, uh, but we wouldn't trade it for the world. We got a five-year-old, we got a three-year-old, and we got a one-year-old. They don't like to sit still for some reason. I don't know what, what the deal is with that. We have a really fun, kind of unique setup where I work with my wife on a daily basis. And sometimes she probably doesn't like it as much as I do. It allows us to be really family-oriented. Let's build a lifestyle that we can go to the park with the kids. Like, loves to you know, be a mother and be that working professional as well. She's everything. I mean, I fell in love with her because she's beautiful. But then, when I get to know her, I found out she's really a big nerd. Okay, she's a CPA, so she loves numbers. But that's what people don't realize is that she's wicked smart along to go with the looks. So, as all mothers, Alicia puts family first. All right, mom's got the puck. She deeks Logan. She's going down. Griffin falls down. She's got a wide open goal. Woo! Even though like, she loves working, like that's important to her as well. So it's finding that, that right balance. The one thing that I always tell people is that like, she's the most caring person I've ever met. And it's, people sometimes just say that, but like I really do mean that. Like she's so compassionate towards other people's feelings, especially your kids. And so like mo like all mothers, um, they always will put their kids ahead of themselves, and sometimes to a fault. And so that's what I think that women these days, when they have so much going on, they have they work outside the home, they work inside the home, is they have to take time for themselves. It's hard to do, and they they feel guilty. When it comes to shopping, I actually kind of have the shopping gene. And it's not that Alicia doesn't have good taste, she actually has great taste. She just doesn't enjoy shopping because to her it's overwhelming. And so that's where Allie J came in and it was perfect because they come in, they take you by the hand, and they help you build your wardrobe, you know, and build three or five or six outfits for all these things coming up. To me, it's just a no-brainer. And so sometimes I'm like, okay, it's time to go back, we need to go to Allie J. And she's always kind of hesitant, but as soon as she walks in the door, like, you can just see the mood changes, and she's like, all right, let's do this. My, my favorite part is when she goes to Allie J, and she, she calls me as soon as she gets up, and I go, and I go how'd it go? She goes, I dominated. And what she means is Allie J came in, and they like helped her figure out everything from the earrings down to the boots and everything in between. And, but the best part is she comes out with just renewed self-confidence. Like, okay, I got the outfit for the next occasion, I know exactly what to wear. I don't have to have that five hour conversation with myself, like what am I gonna wear? And then yell at my husband because he, somehow he is a part of this. It's so fun to have a wife who can one night, you know, dress up to the nines and go up and then all of a sudden turn around and put a different hat on and she's just getting playing in the sandbox, getting dirty with all the guys. To me, that's what real beauty is. You know, it's not just, you know, I can look really good with this outfit on, is in all aspects of her life, she's beautiful. And she just shows that through and through, her boys know without a doubt that she loves them, she will do anything. She'll walk to the end of the earth for those boys um, and myself. And to me, that is, that makes me so proud and so blessed to have her in my life. Alicia, you look smoking in that outfit. Now turn around. <laughs>